As many of you may know, uh, Melba Ketchum just released a DNA uh, paper uh, purporting to prove the existence of Bigfoot. Uh, unfortunately, the uh, paper wasn't released in a uh, reputable scientific journal subject to peer review. It was released in what amounts to a website uh, that Melba Ketchum happens to control somehow. Uh, and it amounts to a self-published paper. I'm not sure what to think about this. Uh, I have a strong science background. Uh, I'm a criminal defense attorney, so I'm not unfamiliar with DNA. But you know something? I'm not a DNA scientist. I could read this paper, and I don't know if it would be solid or not. That's why it's so important to have peer review, so that you have her peers, or people who are supposed to be her peers, experts in the field of DNA, uh, look at it and say, yes, the science and the methodology are sound. Or no, the science and the methodology is not sound. Uh, so unfortunately, those of us who may have been waiting for this for some time are, are left with a, a really empty feeling about the whole thing. And quite frankly, uh, feeling like we've been hoaxed or fooled somehow. Uh, I don't know Melba Ketchum. I've never met her. I've never spoken with her. I don't want to sit here and say she's a liar or a hoaxer because I don't know. I do not know the woman. I also can't say that she's, you know, so honest that uh, we should not question her at all because I don't know that either. Uh, it's kind of unfortunate the way things have turned out uh, for her sake if this is genuine and her science and methodology is sound uh, someday it'll be borne out Oxford University is working on their own DNA study uh, if their results come out and confirm hers she's going to look pretty good if and when we find a body of a Bigfoot and uh, DNA uh, research is done with a known sample and it bears out her research and her conclusions she's going to look pretty good so you know from her standpoint uh, her best days might be ahead unless of course she's been trying to fool us all along in which case uh, things are not going to get better for her so as usual we'll just have to wait and see until next time SasquatchCamp.com thank you